Portland is a very unique market. I like to call it the Vatican of craft beer. When you drink craft beer and you drink Widmer Brothers beer, those hops are coming from right down the road. Those malts are brought in from farms right around this region. The water is some of the cleanest water. Water is a very important resource in the brewing process, so we're committed to using as less water as possible for every bottle of beer that we create. In talking with Julia, we began to understand some of their pain points as far as vacuum goes. And one of the biggest pain points that, that she had expressed was the large use of water that they were going through, not only on a daily basis, but on a monthly and an annual basis. So we knew that this vacuum pump was a unique challenge that we wanted to address. It wasn't a solution that already existed for craft breweries for a vacuum pump. We were looking for one that wouldn't use water in its application. So Atlas Cop Co jumped in and helped partner with us to innovate a new solution that could solve that problem. So where the GHS BSD Plus came into play, we were able to better understand their process as far as the bottling goes, the variation between the different beers, and how that comes into play as far as how we need to filter out some of those things before it gets to the vacuum pump. The vacuum pump definitely was in line with our sustainability commitment. We've seen significant water savings. We save about 5,000 gallons of water a day, and that cost savings is up to $35,000 a year. Craft Brewery Alliance is the first to install a vacuum pump in a craft brewery that doesn't use water for cooling, and we're excited to be pioneers in this with Atlas Copco and able to share this across the industry as well. They've done everything we've been looking for and more. I feel like our, you know, we're aligned in our goals together as companies of what we want to do you know, and to help the environment to make sure we're creating the best quality products. We're very excited to be working with Atlas Company.